Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the Canary channel, which is the build 26241 for version 24H2. In this video, as always, we're going to talk about what is new, what has changed, and also what is fixed in this latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the Canary channel. So if you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBased channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. First of all, as always, Microsoft is mentioning that they included a small set of general improvements and fixes that will improve the overall experience for insiders running this build on their PCs. And related to new features, we have a new feature related to the file explorer. So we can now easily go into the file explorer and drag and drop files in our address bar. As easy as that, this should now be enabled for every Windows insider. So I think that is pretty cool. As you can see, I can easily move files through different locations in the file explorer address bar. Also related to Windows recall, Microsoft seems to have it removed for also from the insider preview builds and also from the official Windows 11 24H2 release. So the recall AI function will come back maybe in the future when Microsoft polishes it more. As spotted by Phantom Motion 3, we have a new energy recommendation in settings, which is turn off HDR to conserve energy. And this is disabled by default, but can be manually enabled, of course, if you have HDR support on your system. So thank you to Phantom Motion 3 for this find. In this build, we also have a few fixes. For example, related to the taskbar, Microsoft updated the app icon flashing in the taskbar to be a bit easier to see. Related to the file explorer, as some insiders have noticed, Microsoft updated file explorer so it's a little easier to see when you have files or folders selected by adding a thin border to the selected area so we can see that right now and I think that is pretty good. Also fix an underlying issue causing file explorer to crash when going to home for some insiders in the last few flights. Related to notifications, Microsoft updated the underlying logic for when they suggest turning off notifications for certain apps so that it requires a longer period of time without engaging with notifications from that app in order to trigger. Microsoft is also investigating reports that some Windows insiders in the Canary and Dev channels are stuck on the build 26040 or build 23620. The investigation is ongoing, however, if you are impacted by this and really want to get into the latest build in the Canary or Dev channel today, you can get the latest ISO from the official Microsoft website. So this is pretty much all there is to it to this latest Canary channel build. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.